Off play action, Buckner dumps it down. Going to try to get the ball as many times as possible to Mayer. But again, they tackle him soon after the catch. That was Hickman. Boy, just tremendous awareness and speed. Watch here. He was going to follow 87 all the way across. Knows that ball could be thrown to him out in the flat. And as soon as the big man makes the catch, how about that play? Five-man rush. Buckner delivers in a heavy traffic. It's incomplete on the carom. Tried to force the ball in there to Braden Lindsay in his fourth down. Boy, he's doing it. Jim Knowles is doing a really good job of mixing up his looks. Watch his safety, Ronnie Hickman. Kind of kind of hiding there as like a spy. And then he looks up the crosser. And Buckner re never really felt him. I think he thought he was maybe coming up, not going to be in that position. And just his body being there affected the vision there of his receiver. Uh, 350. Yeah, and look, look how Stroud waits into that last possible second. Nice job there by Buka working back to the football and then getting a foot down to get that, that first down. And remember that that drive stat started after a 66-yard punt by Arkansas State. Now a sidearm throw and maybe a smidge behind the receiver. And so Kaihe Wally doesn't hang on to James Blackman's second pass of the game. Ohio State defensively, you're going to see a lot of coverage that creates tight windows. This is third down to three, Arkansas State. And a quick throw by Blackman. It's caught at the 30-yard line. Chant Fleming's retreating. We'll see what the forward progress spot is. He was thrown backwards, but forward progress will be given to the 30. However, Joshua, that's not what they need. No, in Arkansas State here, do you go for it? Is this a situation where you say, we're coming into the shoe? This is a tough environment. Possessions are going to be hard to come by. Paid in front by 15, heading to the last two and a half minutes for the first half. Johnny Lang running. And down he goes, tackled by Ronnie Hickman. Just those inside runs, Tim. They're going to need a lot more. That's what they need. Pressure oh, off the edge, and there's the pick. That's the one thing they were looking for. An interception. And it's taken away by Ronnie, Ronnie Hickman. Hickman. Yep. Ronnie was lurking in that free safety position. All 6'1", 207 of them. The ball Catholic. And Jimmy, he read it like a computer squeezed it the quarterback made the right throw in terms of where he wanted to go but the speed and athleticism to close those gaps you see he's giving him the invitation to throw it halfing on the numbers and then closing that's what you want from a safety range and that's exactly what hickman delivers nine yard what return by hickman after the interception he's the first buckeye in six years with 100 tackles in a season raquan mcmillan did the here comes pressure Simon hit as he throws incomplete. They were coming from all angles, and Simon didn't have a chance for it down. That's exactly what I was talking about right there. You're able to capture that momentum. You affect the passer when you get up on him. You don't have to get the sack always. You see Chambers, Hickman's running right there down the chute, able to get up on the quarterback, affects the throw, and it stops this Rutgers drive, their best drive of the day. Second down and seven. Singleton the deep man. He'll give it to him. And Singleton plowing forward. They get to the 21 on the play. A one-yard gain to Imoloa defensively. And that'll bring up third down and manager. And watch these safeties all day. Gus, you, you know, you've heard me talk about them all week long. Right there, that was Ronnie Hickman. They play with three safeties in the in the game. Lathan Ransom, Tanner McAllister, Ronnie Hickman. And you never know which one's going to be deep, if there's going to be two deep. Sean Clifford with time. Clifford underneath and incomplete. With the conservative route on that play, Theo Johnson is tied in. And now the Nittany Lions are punted away with 1.17 to go. Yeah, and one of the reasons, Gus, that they had to be conservative there is because Ohio State showed tight man coverage, and then they dropped back with two deep safeties. That's what I'm talking about, about disguise, and then that forces Clifford to have to check the ball down short of the sticks, and there the linebackers were waiting for the tight end, Theo Johnson. For Penn State to start the second half, Clifford. Makes a man miss. Clifford throws on the move. Nice gun. Ah! Mitchell Tinsley just couldn't hold on. In heavy traffic, Ronnie Hickman defensively for the Bucks. Boy, Clifford 
evaded a free rusher, and this was a great throw to Tinsley, and he's bobbling, bobbling, and then finally gets contacted by Ronnie Hickman there, and it's incomplete. Design rollout. Catch in the flat, but no first down. Malik Washington ripped out by Ronnie Hickman. And the Buckeyes take over on downs at their own 21. Ronnie Hickman is having an excellent year for this defense. The defense now has five defensive backs. He's one of the safeties, and he does a nice job catching up to Washington and then making the sure tackle out in space. It was a good play call and design, but Hickman just made an outstanding play. Porter, big hole, and a good tackle by Ronnie Hickman to prevent a much bigger play. Porter got swung around. Some of the Wildcat fans thought that was a face mask. It was not. Ronnie Hickman made the tackle. My question would be to Sullivan again. Dumped at the 36-yard line. It's Hickman again. You mentioned Ronnie Hickman was the team's leading tackler a year ago in a different defensive scheme, and he is picking up the same way this year. Down and eight at the 11. Williams sets up a screen on the far side, doesn't fool anybody. How about that? Ronnie Hickman brings down A.J. Barner. A loss of two yards. He had him in man coverage, just followed him across the formation and was there to make the stop. Hickman has been really good this year. Gustin. Third down and four. Let's see if Dexter Williams can move this football. Dexter throws it to the sideline. Oh, incomplete. Ronnie Hickman in coverage. Simmons, the target. This Ohio State defense continues to swarm. Yeah, there's just, there's not a unit in this country that has improved more and just great timing by Hickman. He doesn't ever turn back, but he didn't impede Simmons' ability to catch the ball until the ball arrives. Third down and five. Tonga Vibola looking for an option. Now he's gonna sprint it himself, and it will be first and goal, Maryland. Hickman and Ransom had a collapse on him.